Weather Authority forecast. This is Good Morning Cincinnati, live on Local 12. And good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Good Morning Cincinnati. Now at 930, I'm Bob Herzl. I'm Sheila Gray. And I'm John Lomax and Jen and Tara, both working from home this morning. I first came into work, we had a mix of sun and clouds, about Mm -hmm. about 50-50 mix. It seems like, uh, looking at the weather cameras, we're seeing more clouds right now. Yeah. Yeah, and even some places, I think, trying to hold off a little rain. Right, Tara? Yeah, the rain is moving in, moving in uh, for the morning, but increasing for us into the afternoon hours. You can see those lowered clouds and that haziness over a great shot at the bend in the river. Cincinnati at 75 degrees. We're still warm and very humid for you as well. That dew point of 64, light northeast winds. And so a low to the south of us is slowly moving off to the north and to the east. And we're going to get some wraparound moisture at times. And that's what you're going to find here east, Claremont and Brown, your rain is actually moving from the southwest and headed back towards the uh, southeast and headed back towards the northwest. If I can get it all together here. (laughs) Alexandria at 74 degrees, uh, Mount Orab at 72 and socked under that rainfall. Still dry in the city though at 75. Louisville has just been inundated with rainfall inches upon inches, two, three inches, some spots uh, upwards of four, and flash flood warnings continue for one, two, three, four, five, six different counties being uh, popping up right now. That heavier rain is just approaching Carroll County and Owen County, but we also have some heavier pockets into Ohio too. Lightning flashes have decreased, so that intensity, the electricity has decided to kind of fizzle out a little bit, which is good to see. That makes it safer, but still some really heavy rain outside of Bethel. For us towards New Richmond, you could be seeing an increase of rain as well as over Moscow and Alexandria. Showers and thunderstorms are not just right there in southern sections of Claremont, but you have a lot of brown covered and even southern sections of Highland County towards White Oak Township with some heavy rainfall for you too. Finally, a model picking up on the rain. This is our rapid refresh bottle. It's doing a pretty good job. It's actually adding a bit more than what we have. Let me show you currently. So it's it's taking a little bit farther to the north than what we currently have, but still it's picking up on a, a nice amount of moisture. And so I like where they're going. It looks like more of an event for most of us today. Then decreasing into the evening hours, south and east, keep it heavier until the morning hours on Saturday and it starts to shift with some heavier rain to the west. That line slowly shifts to the east as our low shifts to the east and we do get some dry hours in the afternoon and evening on Saturday. Another round of wet weather on Sunday, especially in the afternoon with the official cold front, but that clears out the humidity and the heat and we get back the sunshine to start out next week. So rain gear needed and looks like you're gonna need it over the weekend too. Guys, back to you. Thanks, Tara.